so today guys we're gonna talk all about this Nissan Patrol Royale. Let's go! We're here in Liwa, Liu Liwa, Zambales. This is our pee, our peace place. Actually, we've been lately our peace place. Sobra na katuwa dito. It's very, very calming. The place is really nice. It's the beach is nice. It's not perfect, but it's really nice. So, yep. This we want to share to you guys that this is our peace place. But please, wag niyo bubugbugin yung lugar do. Pero yeah, this is a very, very conservative place. Uh, you can surf, but today there's no there's no waves. So yeah, people are here. Joseph, Justin, Chino, Gino, yeah, Jason, Hoda Bear. So hi guys. Tess is there. So yon. Uh, we'll we'll be waiting for our friends pa tomorrow. So we're enjoying the place here. So before anything else, as I've shared to you our peace place, I want to let you know that we drove a freaking tank here tank an elegant tank guys it's not just a regular tank it's not just a regular car but it's an elegant fancy gas guzzling tank and this is the 2022 Nissan Patrol guys looks so good the exterior part of this facelifted Patrol Royale is really really giving me the chills of having one I always dreamed of buying a second-hand Nissan Patrol Royale like a 2012 model but guys and then facelift the facelift the car to this kind of face but guys this car is super epic it's a V8 engine it has a V8 engine gas petrol engine guys and yes Alam ko na, unahan ko na kayo sa una pala ng vlog. It's really gas guzzling. Uh, hindi, siya, hindi mo siya sasabihin na tipid. Never, I will never tell you na tipid yung kotse. But it goes around for a highway since we drove on NLEX, SCTEX. Goes around 8 to 10 probably. And then for the city drive yesterday, I was, since I was driving it in Manila. Uh, it just, <laughs> sorry but it's kind of funny. It goes around 3 to 4 km per liter. 5 would be the max. But the comfort of this car is just epic, guys. Ibang iba. Pero grabe yung itsura pa lang. I mean, if you want to, yun nga, may sa akin ng friend, like, would you choose this over the counterpart of the Nis Nissan Patrol? I told them that it's a matter of preference, guys. Hindi lahat magugustuhan to, hindi lahat magugustuhan din yun. But guys, if you're considering this one, one main Thing that I would say to you it's very silky it drives like a yacht sobrang lambot ng suspension sobrang ganda ng ride the steering feeling is super duper epic sobrang lambot the gas engine alam nyo sa totoo lang I'm not really a super duper fan of diesel engines but guys this one the petrol engine for this specific car this V8 petrol engine is super duper duper good runs really well it runs fast definitely with a V8 it doesn't give you the roaring engine but guys it's very very comfortable this car is an epitome of comfortable comfortability I don't know if there's there's such word I don't know pero grabe sobrang komportable ng kotse nito I'll give you a really really honest review with this car because to be honest I like it I, I also like I also love the Land Cruiser but guys this is definitely a must-have if you want to have a Land Cruiser buy another one this patrol ride guys okay let's go with the exterior first with the new Nissan emblem right here shouting up front and then the v-shaped grill that ha that's the Nissan's been marketing every now and then and then the DRL for this car I'm not sure if, if it will show you but 
when I unlock the car later, I'll try to let you guys see. But guys, the front fascia of this car super epic. Looks really good. Pinag-isipan talaga. Tapos sobrang macho niya. Then 18 inch wheels right here with a new center, new Nissan logo center cap. And then it's running on Dweller HT. It's running on 20 inch wheels guys with the new Nissan center cap right there. It's run the tires are really good. It's a Bridgestone Dweller HT. Runs around 275, 60, 20. So guys, the look of the wheels, the mag wheels is super nice. It looks really good. It's very, very elegant, yet you can use it as a rugged brick, to be honest. And it looks, it, it will still look elegant, whatever you do. So there's this shouting patrol grill, full grill right here. And then a V8 emblem right here. It's a 5.6 liter petrol. So don't don't forget that. And then of course this one, you mga unlock keyless entry. It's definitely here. And then by the way, I, I haven't talked about the color of the car. This is somehow a silver. I'll try to take off my sunglasses. And yes, it's a silver. And the silver on this car looks freaking elegant i don't know but it's still a normal color for cars but this one looks really really good okay and then the suspension guys super super grabe and then it has 360 cameras uh two in the side mirrors front grille one then rear camera for the rear trunk and then the chrome trimming right here gives the car a huge huge luxury feels for me then the tail light super good that's a face lifted tail light already tow hitch guys i mean the back of the car is relatively simple to be honest it's quite simple but it gives you that elegant look pa rin na parang uy anong coach ito parang pag hindi mo nakita yung badge or what anong coach ito ang macho di ba parang ganun so for me it's a, it's a plus point for the fascia of the rear so side profile will be the same Okay, let's go to the interior, guys. I mean, that's the best part, to be honest. Depending on my move on, I'll give you a walk around of the car because I can't move on with the front fascia of the car. Grabe talaga. So, so damn good looking. See? Then going around. Grabe. Looks super good. Grabe talaga going around so I'll give you a quick walk around of the car outside so yeah then it has a silver roof rail right there and then guys the interior to be honest it's been face lifted also from the past patrol royale and I'll let you guys see ko ano yung mga nagustuhan ko dito sa interior na because it's really really nice so let's go in uh huh first look at that sidings the orange leather for the interior is epic. It's super nice. Sobrang ganda. Tapos may mga ganito pang feel so. Yung nakatuck. It looks really elegant. And then you can set your seats. And then all windows are automatic of course. So one up, one down. And then folding side mirrors, adjustable side mirrors. And then here's the adjusting power, adjusting seats. That has lumbar support. And then here, there's the rear trunk opener, power door on and off, then the sensors. So it has a foot brake by the way. So isang, isang bagay yun na kailangan nyo malaman when you're driving this car. So wait, tag lang ako ng feet. I'll give you a quick tour of the interior. I'll start it up so that you'll see the gauges. Okay, look at the gauge. It's gonna shout patrol. Oh! <laughs> so damn good looking sobrang ganda it has a lot of features for the gauge you can control them here by the way from you can control the gauge here and then you can control the uh, head unit here and then th this is for the cruise controls and then voice commands is here and also the new Nissan um, badge is also up front here in your steering wheel so guys isa pa Ito ay lang ako talaga mabati kasi ever since I tried to sit on a Patrol Royale 
I've noticed this part. Hindi man sa full, hindi man sa full, but this part, this wooden part is really really good. When you're driving a car like this, uh, it feels so good. Uh, parang yung 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 wood trims na ganyan, it feels so sophisticated. The the, the, the when you hold it, it's kind of I don't know the I, I can't explain the feeling, but it's really elegant. At the same time, it feels so good when you're holding a wood panel in your steering wheel. Usually, kasi yung mga wood panel nandito lang sa taas. This one, it's 360, half 360, so sobrang solid. So, gauge, here you go. You can check out the other settings like the compass, the music, the off-roading, the auxiliary gauges. There's a lot of features right here. Then the settings and then the speedometer. So, yep, everything's right there. And then you can adjust your trip here and then the illumination of the gauges is also here. And then I love how this looks guys. This sharp corner right here for the air vent. And then it will mix with the wood trimming right here. Super nice. Oh by the way, the sound system of the car is Bose sound system. And then look at the siding. So crappy. Look at the chair. Crabby. It's all leather. It's all high quality orange leather guys i love it i super love it and then this panel right here is a different one a face lifted one from the past patrol reals so it has apple carplay already and then you can connect via usb or uh, wireless apple carplay so there you go and then you can control the head unit right here there's there's like maps there's like am fm of course the normal ones then the dimming of the head units right here seat track volume push for the power and then air convents is very very minimalist and then the air con control system is very minimalist too i like it and then this one it, there's a wireless charger right there and then a, a power socket right there and then usb c and then the normal USB. And then this is what I'm telling you a while ago. There, it, there's, there's a lot of features for the driving modes. You can choose sand, on-road, rock, snow. And then the four low and four high, of course, it's right there. And then diff lock, everything is here for, for the off-roading. It's already here. So the shift knob looks really nice. I like it. You can control the head unit from right here, but it's also touchscreen. So, yep camera 360 camera right there you can check everything you want and then guys it has this teeny tiny sunroof <laughs> for me to be honest like it's kind of small for the car i won't judge but if this is a panoramic sunroof right here it's gonna be epic in my opinion can you just imagine like a huge sunroof right here and you're driving a patrol royal super epic so yun and then two cup holders right here it, it's huge actually and then cool box right here yep and then glove box right here yep and then this is leather guys i mean even this one so i love how it feels sorry this is plastic this is leather the aircon is really really good of course it's a nissan so so guys um the here you can there's like a sunglass holder an auto dimming rear view mirror and then there's the lights here and then the controls for the sunroof is right here so you can open it like this and then close it like this yep and i think you can tilt it okay it's also tiltable so yep you can tilt it then you can close it with just a finger so everything in the interior guys is super epic the sound system is really good by the way and then of course pang kikai kit so yun okay there's a lot going in here guys you need to try this car to be honest if you have a friend or if there's a test drive nearby you uh your place definitely try this car and definitely consider this one over its competitor the engine niya, guys sobrang tahimik di ako move on until now to be honest and then push start push start, start and stop engine push start right there 
and then what more and then the rear okay the rear seat <laughs> i'll let you try it guys it's epic it's really huge okay we'll go to the rear part let's just turn off the car so and by the way let's open the hood so that you see the v8 monster so yep okay and then for the rear seat guys look at that it's super duper 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 spacious look at my feet look at that super duper spacious guys guys i can like sleep here if i want to then this one you can also t open it for the cool box from the rear then uh air con controls right here usb right here usb ports sound system at the back of course and then air con louvers and also the trunk is really huge and this part is also chairs that you can pull it up so if you want to sit like two more kids out at the back definitely you can do that armrest right here with cup holders super good yeah big guys i mean the car itself is really nice look at the front grabe sobrang ganda as in this car is definitely a must must have so if you want an executive feeling car yet you're kind of unique from other people like from the land cruiser field this is definitely it okay going to the engine i hope this has like gas struts oh it has so there you go this is the v8 engine petrol engine by the way it's a petrol engine it's a gas engine guys Sobrang gandang manakbo ng makina na to. Super! As in, sobrang ganda ng, sobrang pino ng paggagawa sa kanya. To be honest, I'm really happy with the car. It drives really well. It drives very, very comfortable. It drives epic, to be honest. It, I have nothing to say about the car. Uh, just like the mini features that it, ha it doesn't have compared to other brands. But, guys, it compensates. To be honest, the price point is really, really huge difference with the other brands but guys i mean you million na yun hindi mo mauubos sa gas yun i think so i don't think so uh, na mahal na ng diesel ngayon di ba mga ganun stuff so yep close the hood looks really nice the car grabe so yun guys uh i'll give you a driving with banawe boy segment right after this video this part i'll drive it in manila not here because I, I can't explain you to you how good the suspension system, the, the steering handling here in the sand. So I'll be driving it in Manila on Monday so that I'll show you and I'll tell you how good this car is. So yun, uh, I'll give you definitely a second look for the car right there. So yep. So let's go ahead with the Driving with Banana Boy segment. Let's go. So hi guys, uh, this is the Driving with Banao Boy segment for this 2022 Nissan Patrol guys. And I'm really really excited to share this with you guys because we've been using the car for the weekend and I am really really happy with this car. And as I've told you, I want one. I really want one. Kaidi pero grabe. This Nissan Patrol Royale, this 2022 version is definitely a must-have, especially with a new interior, with a refined, more refined interior. Grabe, sobrang sarap gamitin ng kotse ko. So we went to Zambales and back here in Manila, and yung comfort natin going that the travel, the comfort for the travel is epic. Sobrang sarap gamitin. Dumating kami na Manila, lahat kami hindi pagod, lahat kami sobrang comfortable na to the point na kaya pa namin bumiyahe kasi nga sobrang comfortable ng kotse. So this this is dito po pasok yung thoughts na even though you buy uh, expensive cars like this such as this 2022 Patrol Royale. Uh, the, the concept of buying an expensive car and a petrol engine car is for me is yung comfort 
parang hindi mo kaya palitan yung comfort na binabayaran mo doon. So, doon ma-justify yung binabayaran mo na ng premium for this kind of cars. Grabe. Yung engine na V8 is super duper duper sulit because sobrang tahimik niya compared to a diesel engine. And yung power is definitely there. Hindi ka niya bibitinin on highways, on um, overtakings. Definitely sobrang tulin niya. And the engine roar is super... Uh, when you're a car guy and you hear an V8 engine roar, even naman sa mga classic cars, pero sa mga uh, modern cars with a V8, it's, it's grabe yung tunog. Sobrang panalo talaga. So it's very, very orgasmic actually. So, yun, I'm really happy with this car. Definitely, I would recommend this car. Def sa mga friends, actually, may mga nagtatanong na nga sa, oh bro, kamusta yung patrol? You've been using it. Sabi ko, yes bro. I am really happy with the car. To be honest, uh, let's, hindi tayo, huwag tayo maging bias. Yes, malakas sa gas. Totoo naman yun. I mean, you're driving a V8. So, when you buy this kinds of car, these kinds of car, um, technically, hindi mm, naman sa ano, pero kahit pa paano may panggas ka rin naman talaga. Kasi it's really expensive uh, for, compared to a normal eco economy car, right? Pero, mm, yung comfort, yung, yung hindi ka pagod, yung ang sarap ng upo mo, ang sarap ng ride mo, yun yung kapalit ng premium na binabayaran mo talaga. So, I'm pretty sure you are, you'll be able to gas it up every now and then if you have the money to buy this kind of car. So, uh, I think this goes around 4 km per liter here in the city on, on, on a practical basis. And then on a highway, it goes around 8 to 10. So, yun yung practical way of uh, thinking ng uh, doon sa gas consumption niya when we're using it. So, grabe. Ito, especially tong steering wheel na to, sobrang happy ako na ganito siya. I'm really happy na sobrang respond, sobrang slambot. Grabe lambot ng steering niya. Hindi ka yung medyo kailangan mo mag-exert ng effort. Medyo, hin medyo hindi siya ganun. Which is very good on a comfortable car like this. Tapos, uh, yung steering, wood steering wheel niya na 360 is definitely my favorite. Tapos yung, I call this tombstone style because it looks like a tombstone but it is really, really nice. And then the sound system is definitely good. It's a Bose. Tapos, uh, well, basically, yung comfort lang talaga, pwede ko talaga ipush at ipush sa inyo. When you're when when I want to share this driving with Banawe Boy segment, because it's really comfortable, guys. To the point na yung mga lubak hindi mo mararamdaman yung yung takbo niya sobrang refined hindi mo. Technically, the engine you won't hear it roaring every time, because hindi mo kailangan ng high revving power for it to go on a normal scale na takbo. Eto pa maganda. When, it, when we're driving it on a highway, it goes around 1,600 to 800 RPM lang just for it to cruise 100 km per hour na speed. Can you just imagine that? Sobrang baba nung, ano niya, nung, nung RPM niya for 100 km per hour speed. So I'm really, really happy with, the, with this car, definitely. If you want to drive it for like lalo na pag yung mga highway drivers kayo like yung family nyo loves to go on a road trip on a really good uh, scenic roads with a 4x4 car so yun uh, gusto ko lang talaga masabi for this car uh, it's very comfortable so yun uh, I'm ending this vlog here I'm definitely recommending this 2022 Nissan Patrol Royale and if you want to buy one, feel free to message Nissan Philippines and Nissan dealer dealership throughout the nation. So thank you very much for watching. Please do like and subscribe on our YouTube channel. Definitely follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and all of our social me media accounts, even TikTok, with Banawe Boy No Space. So see you guys soon. Sobrang luwag niya. Ang layo ko kayong hahampasin. Bye!